Alright, so the boxer with a beautiful combination there and given a lot of oh, he's got him hurt here. Oh, that's a big connection for Justin Gaethje and really just loves being in that octagon. I'm not sure anybody loves fighting as much as Gaethje. People don't enjoy being in someone's face, getting punched and landing punches as much as Justin Gaethje. He's right where he wants to go. That shot is blocked by Sanchez. Well, mixing it up beautifully tonight. Now he touches him with the left. Well, it looks as though that strike maybe opened up a cut around the eye area. Yeah, it looks like that strike opened up a cut, John, but it's nothing to worry about now. But he's got to start to protect it. Under three minutes now to go on the round. Back and forth we go. Punches in bunches as he lands another combination there. Really doing a nice job stringing his shots together. He's doing a great job of stringing the shots together and also just mixing up the target and the attacks. Great job finding different places for his strikes to land. Nice punch lands over the top. He's got great kicks also. He needs to be throwing more kicks in this fight. He hasn't thrown uh, many at all. Cut. Now we're going. Well, Gage's overhand telegraph, though, it gets blocked. All right, so that opened up a cut around his eye area. He hasn't moved his head well. He was taking shots too clean, and now a cut is opened up. Oh, he got it like that as a two-time United States Olympian as he goes to the ankle pick to get the takedown. I mean, it speaks to the wrestling acumen. Just the ability to find any takedown available. What a beautiful ankle pick. Watch one ball here. Ooh, looks like it might be locked in. Once he gets you going, he's got so many ways to finish arm bars. That is a beautiful transition to try to get the finish. Oh, he got up! He actually defended. Now, he's not in a great position now, but he's better off than he was before. Well, very efficient and effective with the ground and pound strikes here. High level work by Sanchez. Second round, straight ahead. Gaethje's nose is bleeding now. Looks to be cut perhaps there on the bridge. All right, so there's the end of the round, and on one side, thrill on the other agony after that knockdown. Yeah, he was able to really damage him with that big punch. You see the hand. You ready? You ready? Go. All right, round two. All right, next round is now underway. Do you see any major takeaways after the previous five minutes? That both of these guys are very evenly matched. The matchmaker did a... Right there, his opponent's Robert He's hurt bad. He cannot take another shot like that. Got to be careful here. Well, it's been a wild fight thus far. Perhaps a contender for some bonus money at fight's end. These guys are going to have to dig deep. They're both hurt. They're both hurt. You expected it, though. You expected a close fight. You did not expect a war like this, though, where both guys, from the moment they said fight, went forward, got in each other's face. Gentlemen, I think my mother just turned off the TV, but every time... Oh, oh shoot, Oh, nice game. Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. He's going to enjoy watching this one back. Let's take a look at the replay of the knockout just a moment ago. It was right hand after right hand after right hand. Finally, he found the one that hit the exact sweet spot that ended his opponent's night. Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Deans called a stop to this contest at one minute, 46 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by no!